if the Paris Climate Agreement involving 177 yes. countries was completely implemented, okay, the entire climate agreement completely implemented, you have distinguished scientists, including Bjorn uh, Lomborg and 27 other top climate scientists, including three Nobel laureates, have concluded that the reduction in global warming would only be one twentieth of a degree Celsius by 2030, one sixth of a degree Celsius in the next 85 years. It sounds to me like if they're anywhere close to being right, uh, then this uh, Paris climate agreement is almost all pain and no gain. Why is that not the case? Well, no, sir. The Paris Agreement was an incredible achievement that changed the direction of the world and is going to ultimately. Do you, do you allow disagree us to that? Climate. Do you think the Paris Climate Agreement will have a greater impact on climate change than I just said and that these 27 scientists said? I think, I think it sets us on a course, course to work together on a planetary scale to address the biggest uh, environmental I understand. As far as the actual made. impact on climate change, do you disagree with these? 27 top I disagree with the way in which you characterize it, Mr. Chairman. With all due respect, it is a tremendous step in the right direction. No, no. The numbers I, you're talking I, those about are, are actually I know those are wonderful words. I'm talking about quantifying the impact. The impact is one sixth of a degree over the next 85 years if every country, all 177 there countries, is not a implement single, it. Uh, sir, there's not a single country that signed that expecting that the 2020 goals would get us where we need to be. Okay. It is a step in that direction and it should provide us an but opportunity. But you don't disagree with the conclusion of these reduction. scientists as far as the climate agreement goes in Paris as it stands right now. The agreement itself was designed as a step forward. It was Understand. not designed to produce all of the actions. Understand, that but will as far as the step forward goes, the, the step forward is as I described well, sir, it. you can't make a marathon without getting across the, the starting line. Okay. It, it's clear you don't disagree with their conclusion. You may think it's a beginning, but you can't I disagree I with their conclusion. I don't know what their conclusion, the context of their conclusions. A what again, I do know, sir, it's is that reducing uh, global warming one sixth of a degree Celsius over the next uh, 85 years. It's better than we were before, and it's only the first step. One we've six made a, for all. We've made an, a long-term commitment to get to the reductions that are necessary. It sounds to me like it's all pain and no gain. And I think that's why punish the American people if we're not going to have any significant impact on climate change. I actually change. don't think it's punishment. I think it's about leadership, and I think it's Let about me tell continued you, job. Increased electricity costs, slow ec economic growth, and lost jobs is punishment Our on the American people. Our analysis shows that that is not the case with the Clean Power Plan. It provides yeah. ultimate flexibility. Okay, it's you again all these other scientists, and that's okay.